First of all, I want to thank you and the National Journal for focusing on uh, this topic and focusing on it in a way uh, where you try to share the possibility of a win-win, uh, ultimately, between the gray and the browning of uh, our population. And as you said, uh, in LA and in California, the culture wars uh, have been going on for a long time. And this next America was already here. Mm -hmm. uh, and I can tell you, because I, I got elected uh, when Prop 187 was on the ballot, and I was opposed to it. When Three Strikes You're Out was on the ballot, um, I took on Proposition 209. I took on uh, 227, uh, which was the uh, bilingual initiative. And my, my response would be, it's getting better. There's no question that California is more comfortable today with the changing demographics than they were in 1994 uh, and, and through the 90s. That doesn't mean that we're not struggling with uh, the implications of the changing demographics. And uh, the National Journal has pointed out uh, that you know you still have a situation, and you've had it for a long time, by the way. This isn't a new thing in California where older, wider, uh, more conservative voters uh, are voting uh, against investing in education, uh, are voting, we're voting for more draconian uh, criminal laws, uh, we're voting against issues like integrating new Americans and people in the state. And so uh, this is our challenge, but I, I would say overall it's getting better. People are more comfortable Today, there's more intermarriage. Mm -hmm. You know, people are working together. The, the newer generation is, those issues are much less important to them they, than they were to you or I, or certainly to our parents.